This guy here is Captain Chesley Sullenberg, who saved almost 200 lives with the most remarkable emergency landing in aviation history. We go back in time to the 15th of January 2009. Captain Sully commands the US Airways Flight 1549, departing from New York's LaGuardia Airport and heading to Trawa. 155 passengers are on board Sully's A320. The takeoff goes smoothly, just as expected. The plane keeps climbing normally, approaching 3,000 feet, when, suddenly, disaster strikes. A flock of Canada geese collides with the aircraft, knocking out both engines. The aircraft has lost all thrust, meaning it is now essentially a glider over one of the most densely populated cities in the world. So the radios air traffic control and quickly assesses the options, returning to LaGuardia, too far. Diverting to the Tivoli Airport, no guarantee of making it. An emergency watch landing, unprecedented. ETC suggests heading to the Tivoli, but Sue is playing a different game. We've gonna be in the Hudson, he said. Relanding on his thousands of flight hours, the captain glides over the George Washington Bridge, lining up with the river. At 3:31 p.m., Sue is at 20 touched down on the Hudson River at 140 knots. People were pulled out to safety on ferries, and miraculously, everyone survived. Time after, simulations proved that trying to reach New Jersey would have ended catastrophically. So he was endless a hero and left behind one of the most iconic lines in aviation history. I was sure I could do it, but I wasn't sure the plane would let me do it.